This is what some prisoners are experiencing inside Alabama prisons every day. How do we know? Because they're filming it on illegal cell phones and posting these clips on YouTube. This YouTube channel we found is full of videos that appear to be shot inside Alabama prisons, some going back more than four years. This video uploaded in 2018 shows inmates with Alabama Department of Corrections issued clothing beating another inmate. The second video of this same incident appears to show at least one other inmate videoing the same beating on another contraband phone. This video, uploaded a couple of months later, shows an inmate slapping another while threatening him and warning him of the consequences of crossing his gang, even after he's released, saying it only takes one phone call. Easy Weezy still has hell. Maybe the most disturbing theme throughout the most recently uploaded videos is the use of a drug called Flocka. It's a synthetic drug similar to bath salts, and according to these videos, leaves inmates in a catatonic state or rolling around on the floor or stumbling around without any idea where they are or what they're doing. And all of this inside what's supposed to be a secure facility. We've been reporting on contraband phones inside state prisons for more than six years. So we asked the Department of Corrections for an interview to go over what we found, but they turned us down, saying the new prisons commissioner is still in the early stages of his tenure. They did say, quote, possession or use of a contraband cell phone by an inmate is criminal behavior. Contraband cell phones can also be used for other more dangerous criminal activities. As such, the department actively monitors for illegal cell phone use, seeking to eliminate contraband devices from our facilities and enforce laws and policy for corrective action whenever possible. The presence of illegal cell phones, unfortunately, is a challenging and complex issue that affects every correctional system in the country. Jonathan Hardison, WBRC, Fox 6 News, on your side.